Hello, Gemini. We're just going to pop into your universe real quick, Booski. Okay, just get some messages from your guardian spirits to see the energies that are present or energies that may be coming in, anything that we may want to keep away. Okay, so thank you for being here. Thank you for partnering with me. Thank you for listening to me, whether if it's only for a little bit or for a long time, okay? Um, I do feel like something has been going on for quite some time, Gemini, and I do feel like... Um, this next chapter will say your guardian spirits is really wanting you to focus on recovering. Um, I will say opportunities that have been hidden from you. Yes, that is something that I say a lot and I'll probably continue to say it a lot as the energies realign and rechange and restructure here in this space. But um, I, I feel like there's like there's a change of tone <laughs> in the air, in the wind, in the water, um, in the fire, kind of like how people are perceiving you. I don't feel like this is anybody that you are trying to convince or turn or flip. I just feel like your energies are more amplified with this world and wheel of fortune, these two major arcanas here, showing that this next chapter that you're embarking on is that of skill, is that of knowledge, science, and philosophy. Not a lot of things that are really taught I feel like at, at the level they should be taught. Let me give an example. I found out that I actually am interested in philosophy like well into my 30s. Like it wasn't something I was introduced to when I was younger. So some of you guys could be introducing these concepts to people that are younger than you. Uh, maybe you identify as a young adult or you could be a teen. Uh, maybe you have teen. I don't know why I just feel like somebody's younger than you, Gemini. Or I, I just feel like a lot of people look up to you or a lot of people are looking up to you um, over the course of this next 24 hours. This could be the next 24 days. I feel like something's very significant about time and your guardian spirits is wanting you to not Fear time as you have more control of it to use it as a tool, to use it as an elevator, as a staircase to what it is that you really truly want. Especially when we see energies like tells where treasures are hidden. Okay. I feel like everything is changing in a way that is maybe making you uncomfortable, making everybody uncomfortable. Um, this could just be, listen, hey, this is a real part of witchcraft that a lot of people do not want to be honest about if you are reversing or recovering or you are calling your energy back if there's someone that has been rotating off that um <laughs> if they don't find a new energy source gemini that is that six of cups energy where it's like your re oop my bad like where your reputation or your future is increasing but i don't i don't really feel like you're crushing anyone's past but i feel like people from your past feel like you're crushing them or something here or it could be somebody that it could be somebody in your universe that knows that you're really just kind of like here in this three of wands energy, really focused on something big, focused on something grand, focused on really just kind of like elevating all aspects of yourself. And I don't know, I just kind of feel like someone's maybe taking it. Um, I feel like they're just kind of taking it a little hard. So I would say be give yourself grace because I don't feel like this could be anybody in communication with you or these could just be people that you're not really like talking to or engaging with much. This could even be people that are still a part of your life or a part of your future. You're just choosing to like limit the contact. It's like, I feel like you're really in a portal of like immense focus and determination and creativity, like a lot of research. I feel research very heavily here. And whatever research means to you, it could be different. Like you could be an artist, right? Researching different beats or patterns or tones and, you know, constructing something. You could be in research. Um, you could be a part of a research panel. Um Maybe you are a part of a research panel and you don't realize that. Okay, I feel like the Seven of Swords energy, Gemini, and your universe, your guard of spirits is trying to say they're, they're returning items and they're punishing the thieves, right? They're revealing the hidden treasures. They're wanting you to be conscious of the things that have been stolen from you, like ideas or things in your mind, really just kind of like mentally crumbling. But I feel like your guardian spirits is really just trying to get you to understand literally everything that you want to do, you're already doing it. However, there's energies. It could, this could be enemies. This could be jealousy. See, this could be envy. Um, you guys, I watch true crime. I'm getting back to it. So if anybody got to recommend, um, I'm sorry, not anybody, Google, can you please throw some true crime channels on my feed? Um, preferably, um, preferably, um, melanated goddess. Okay. Cause I, I found one at one point and I could have swore, oh, we were like from the same area and, I think even though it didn't seem like it weirded us out at first, I kind of feel like it it weirded us out after the fact because I ended up just unsubscribing. Like, not because I didn't want to watch your content, but I just was like, oh my gosh, I found somebody. <laughs> How did I end up here? Like, you you, you from where? You grew up where? You went to school where? Oh, okay. Um, 
So here with the sun, I do feel a lot of radiance this next 24 hours. Um, but I do also feel like there's a lot of energies that are really just like here for you the next 24 days, Gemini. And with the Six of Cups resurfacing again, I do feel like some of those energies could be people from your past. Um, not bad ones, because I do feel like there's bad ones. And yes, I sound like a 12-year-old when I say it. Okay. Um, but like I was saying about the seven of swords, I feel like your guardian spirit is trying to show you that you're in something now. So it's time for you to dig into it even deeper because now's your time to shine. Like the sun is like, it is like a performance. It is like an audition. And I feel like there's people in your universe auditioning for different things. However, there's an energy here where it's like somebody's trying to get you away from your stage or get you farther away from what it is that you want to build for yourself. It's like, they're trying to, it's like, they're actively and attempt attentively trying to get you to think that you're doing something different than what you're already doing. The Seven of Swords is a very sneaky energy, okay? It's very sneaky energies around your luck, around how you just kind of feel like you are able to make things shake for yourself. At least that's how I um, see it, okay? Eight of Cups here. Okay, I kind of feel like maybe there's just some rough energies that you're smoothing over. Gemini, the course of this next 24 hours, that Eight of Cups just feels like you, um, there's just feels like there's some. Y'all, it sounds like somebody's making a beat with the horn. I feel like there's mutual energies that you are, um. Mutual energies that you're clearing out between maybe you and someone else. Here with this devil energy and the queen of pentacles, I do feel like someone here, your guardian spirits want you to be a little bit more, um, a little bit more receptive to the messages they're trying to give you regarding the, the links that people would go to in order to um, reach fame, power, wealth, status, um, transmutation. Not everybody is walking in the same path. Not everybody's walking in the same shadows. And surely not everybody is walking in the same light. And I feel like this double energy with this um, queen of pentacles, I kind of feel like you have, um, we'll say celestial support energies coming your way. Gemini, this next 24 hours to bring you back Back to a place where you're able to turn your metal into gold, where you can continue to teach yourself the lessons of the world, um, life. The Queen of Pentacles is a very earth rooted energy. She's very down to earth, very practical, very radiant. Okay, she makes her bag inside the house. A lot of people are wanting and or trying to do that. However, I feel like whatever is kind of like coming your way, Gemini, is causing things to mat in your universe in a way that is not allowing flow. So your guardian spirits, I feel like this next 24 hours is not allowing you to be worse off than you were before as someone else's um request someone may be requesting um of their guardian spirits of their ancestors of whoever like oh we don't want gemini to get ahead y'all people do this okay i love you guys bye